Okay guys, right now I'll show you how you can connect a Bluetooth mouse to any iPhone. Now the thing is that I have this kind of third party mouse, you can see this is not the Apple mouse. And you have to of course make sure that it is turned on and the pairing is like enabled. You have to make sure that it has battery and that it's fully charged and stuff, but this is regarding the mouse. What can you do on the iPhone to actually pair it? First disclaimer before we begin, if you use the Apple Magic Mouse and you want to connect this one to the iPhone, you will not be able to most likely. Well, you technically can connect the Magic Mouse to the iPhone, but it has to be the first generation. This one is the second generation. How do you know which one you have? Well, the first gen has a physical place to put like AA batteries inside or AAA, I believe. And this one is chargeable. So in case you have a chargeable Magic Mouse, you cannot connect it to iPhone. But if you have the old one where you physically have to put the batteries in, that one can be connected using the very same method which I choose. Anyways, so the thing how it or the way how it works is that I open up the settings on my iPhone like this and you may be tempted to go to the Bluetooth section like this and look up the mouse in here, but it's just not going to appear here. Instead, what you have to do is go to the general section, then click on accessibility somewhere in here. Accessibility is actually a little bit below there, so click on accessibility right here and I want you to click on the uh, touch or switch control. It doesn't even actually matter, but I'm going to go with switch control and I'm just going to click on switches. So I'm just going to click on an add a Bluetooth device. So it's just going to look for whichever device I have available. So I will just prepare my mouse in here and you can see it actually has like two mice which show up. So I'm just going to click on the first one and it should pair yeah it is connected already so let's connect on sleep it is okay and right now i should be able to use the mouse on the iphone however i still don't have the option to do so since we have to come back to the main section and go to the touch now when you click on a touch i have to turn on the the thing called assistive touch which is going to be at the top I'm just going to turn it on like this and now you can see that we have the thing, the mouse, the cursor going around. So now I can actually use the mouse to show you and point to stuff. So as I told you in the beginning, it doesn't matter if you at first turn on the assistive touch or switch control, but you have to go through it this way. Now the bad part about it is that we still have this assistive touch in here, which we cannot just like remove or anything, but we can make it less visible. So again, if you go to with the touch, assistive touch, you can um, just scroll down a bit more and click on idle opacity and just dial it all the way to the lowest. And right now, when I don't do anything with the button, it just sort of like disappears. You can still sort of see it, that it is there, but it's not like standing in the way all the time. So this is how you can connect the mouse to an iPhone 15. Now, this has been the tutorial from the Fox Tech YouTube channel, but in case you're new to Apple and new to uh, devices and stuff like this, definitely check out the Fox Tech educational platform, which you definitely should join. It is free to do so, and there you can find so many tutorials and enhancement for your iPhones. So much stuff to check out, so definitely go ahead and join right now. It is free to do so. Thanks a lot for watching, and I will see you in the next video.